Next story. What a beautiful day it was outside today, right? I was playing some ball. I couldn't get enough of it. And the weather like this is usually a strong indication that the real spring weather is fighting its way back into our lives. I love it. And it's also a good indication that spring sports are just around the corner. And for the Alpino Wildcats softball team, they're gearing up for yet another successful season. That sound. Softball season has officially begun at Alpena High School. And because of the cold weather, the Lady Wildcats practice inside. Year after year, they've been the top dogs in the Big North Conference, and it's something that's been passed down. Well, the, tradi the tradition of the, the kids want to work extremely hard and build on the success of the kids before them. That's, that's not just this year, but that's, that's, that's the goal of every year. As head coach, Paul Maureen has consistently brought success to Alpena's softball teams, especially after last year's season. We won the Big North title, which is a goal of ours coming out, and we've, we've had a stranglehold on it now for a while. For a while is right. Last year, made it the sixth straight season as conference champs, and they finished the year with a 30-10 and 10 record, which has let the rest of the league know that Alpena, they're the team to beat. That's, that's a really good feeling. Now they also know that we graduated some kids, and so, so I think they're looking at this is a chance to get Alpena, but we're, we're stepping up to the challenge, and then we'll see. Okay, we're, we're, uh, we're going to be quite a bit better than what they're probably thinking. Last year, the Wildcats graduated eight seniors. It's a huge loss of talent, but this year's team captain, Jessica Marweed, is stepping up to the challenge. As a key player to last year's success, Jessica knows what it takes to make it that far and wants her younger teammates to know the feeling. Uh, we just worked really good as a team and I think because we lost so many seniors, we'll just have to work on like rebuilding that connection, which I think we'll do this year. And the excitement that I got from like making it that far and just like being with the girls, I want to bring that to this season and I want the girls to feel excited about every game and so hopefully we make it far this year. And if you ask her if she has one goal before she graduates, Definitely. We're going for a regional title this year. Reporting for WBKB Sports, I'm Scooby McGezzin.